Welcome to Osiris Nodon. I'm back in my base and I was just checking this guy if he actually picked up something. Let's see. No, he's just patrolling and I'm gonna leave him that way. So, on the way back from the satellite dish, I collected a bunch of stuff, space debris on the floor and also a few nodes, so I got a little bit more resources, which is great. And the next mission is to activate the comms relay. As I've seen in the previous episode from the... let's see if I can find it. The missions, it says right here, I gotta go deep in the alpha mine. And this mine is the one right next to the satellite dish. So let's see if I can spot it again. There we go. There's the alpha mine. Let's see. Can I spot the mines? I don't think I can. But there's a mine right next to the satellite dish. So that's where I'm gonna have to go. But also from the logs, I noticed that it could be a lot of monsters in there. And unfortunately, I don't have a weapon. A ranged one. Or the ability to craft one. Let's see if that's the case. No, I don't see any. But uh, maybe... Oh, maybe I can do another upgrade and see what else I can do here in the workbench. Maybe also in the furnace. In the forge here. So let's try to upgrade all of this. And see if I can actually make a weapon. Because I think it would be a good help. So let's just turn all this. No, I don't want to do that. I just want to do the basic stuff. So, yeah, let's turn all these wires. And I think that's all. So let's see, for example, what it would take to do the upgrade for the for the workbench. So it's still the same. We can do the suit station. will allow me to do basically upgrades to put in my suit to give me environment resistance and stuff like that. And there's also the tool station. I think this might be the one that I'm going to go for. Because maybe I can do a weapon here. So I just need Gulf 4 and Bronze. Let's see. Do I have some here? No. But the Bronze should be pretty simple. Just Tin and Magnesium. Tin. I have no Magnesium. Oh man. I'm out of Magnesium again. God damn. But let's see what's the other thing. The Gulf 4. It's not here. Where's the Gulf 4? There it is. Titanium. So let's just pick up some titanium, maybe some iron. Let's do three. Should be good. So I'm going to have to go out and get some magne magnesium. Let's also check the upgrade for the forge. Because there's another one here. I just need some telonite. Which is just chromium, which is awesome. I just picked up a few with a rover. So let's just do one. And let's upgrade the forge. Nicely done. So let's see what else I can do here. I can do a machete. I think I could before. And there we go. Oh, but it takes diamonds. Motherfucking diamonds. But I can also do a pistol. And blast the cells for the pistol. So maybe I'm going to try to do a pistol. It might be better than just a melee weapon. So let's try to do some gunmetal. Let's see. Oh yeah, I need molybdenum. And uh, I'm going to need the bronze, so magnesium. I only got one mol molybdenum. So that's the thing that I'm going to look for. I'm going to go out. Try to get molybdenum and magnesium. I'm just going to park away everything. So let's just put feel like. There you go. And the electrical stuff over there. So I think it's also time to build a new box. Just for the ingots. So let's just put one down. And... Uh, and I put on top. Yeah, but it's going to be a little far away. I think I'm going to put it here on this side. Like this. Right next to the forge. There you go. So this one will be just for the ingots. The alloys. Because before I actually forgot that I had materials here. And I didn't check that box. And I could have. Okay. There you go. So it's much better. This one. I kind of need another one just for the wars too. Because I have no room for the cobalt. So I'm going to take the stones out of here for now. Let's put it in the natural stuff. Okay. Should, should, be, should, should work like this. Nice. And I'm actually going to take... Injuries detected. Oh, thank you, Clarice. I kind of missed your voice. So let's turn all of this too. Here in the furnace. Because the day is almost done. So let's just do a few more things here before going out. Nicely done. And let's turn also this cloth. Okay. So I'm a little bit better suited for the next time around. So let's see. Do I have enough for a workbench? It's just four. Okay. So I should have enough. I'm also going to grab the space debris on the way. Because I would like to get more wires, more circuit boards, more electrical stuff. And that's a good way to get them. So, okay. I think we're set. Another thing. I'm going to drop the bottle here. Because 
I can't really retrieve the water out of the water reclaimer. It just steals the water out for me. So I'm gonna just drink there and I'm gonna keep this bottle so that I can cook. Because otherwise I should be able to do some water later on in a camp station. But for now I don't have it. So let's also see. Okay, I got the rubber. Maybe also. Oh, zircaloid's not gonna happen. A pickaxe diamonds. A machete. Ferrochrome and cast iron. It does 2010 against 1020. But it's only 20% critical hit. But I'm gonna try the machete anyway. Let's try new things. The machete, ferrochrome and cast iron. Ferrochrome, uh, no, that's not cast iron. The cast iron, okay, they're here. I know they're here because I heard them. Let's just do a couple of cast iron. Should be good. There you go, and let's leave the machete and let's go to sleep, shall we? Let's just avoid these bodies. I think it might be better. Just gonna drink some water here. There you go, should be full. Nicely done. I'm gonna pick up the rest of the meat stews. Okay, and let's just sleep. Till 2 a.m. Oh, thank you, Clarice. But uh, let's just have a... Well, this might be too much. It gives me 40. Let's see. Okay, it was just perfect. Nicely done. So let's just drink a little bit more. Hopefully, they'll fix the water reclaimer in the near future. It says 5,000, but it's not. It's almost empty. See that red thing? The bar coming up. This is strange. I'm holding F. And that red bar is going up. I'm not drinking it because I'm full. Yeah, the warrior claimer is just bugged out. That's just how it goes. Okay, well, let's keep moving. Maybe not. It's still too early. So <laughs> I'm just going to check a few things here. Because I have a few things that I can just leave behind. And uh, I was going for molybdenum and magnesium. So let's use the map. Might be easier. Because the last time I used a small radar dish, it actually worked. I found some minerals that I was looking for and it led me right in the good direction. So let's see where's the molybdenum. There's the molybdenum. So there's a bunch here on this valley. So I'm going to put two markers. It's still a little early, but let's just go. I'm just going to fix it. A couple of rocks should be enough. So let's just go down here. I just hope the monster doesn't come. 200 meters. This seems to be carbon. In case you don't know. Uh, we can harvest carbon by just using the rover and running over the nodes. It destroys the rocks and we can pick them up later. Which is awesome. So there's a bunch of crawlies here. Hello. Good morning. How you do? Okay. This seems to be my lignum. There it is. Nice. So, oh boy, that's the sound that I didn't want to hear. God damn, where is he? Oh boy, he's gonna core me. Oh, okay, I think I'm safe. He killed <laughs> Crawly. <laughs> I just heard the noise of something going to the other world. Let's see if that's the case. Yep, he just killed a Crawly. Look at it, poor thing. So let's just harvest them. A Skeliopod. You only give one meat. No, he gave me two. He gave me six. Oh, that's great. Unless I had some before. I don't remember. Nice. So let's just get this molybdenum. And uh, the next thing will be the magnesium. So let's remove this marker here. Okay, this one is done. Let's go for the next one. It should be... Where? Oh, I removed the wrong marker. I guess I did. Clear marker 2, marker 1. Okay, so it should be over there. Okay, I think it's upstairs. So as you can see, there's a lot of space to breathe here. I'm not sure if the buggy will climb this. Oh, but I think that's the one right there on the edge. So let's just leave the buggy. Let's try to get it. 
I think I think the point into the hover boots is helping. Seems to give me a bigger boost. The recharge time kind of feels the same. Oh, it's carbon. It's not this one. So let's just go on foot because I think it's on that ridge. Might be that one rock over there. There we go. I think it is. Oh, nice. There it is. Cool. And uh, why am I doing this? Because from the logs, he gave me the impression that they found monsters in the caves. The ones that I visited, I, I, I've seen no monsters. But the one that I'm going now, since it's a mission, could have those. So I kind of want to go better prepared. And having a pistol, I think it's going to be a good help. So let's see where the magnesium would be. I don't remember. Okay, there it is. Magnesium. So there's one right there. Let's go at it and let's put marker 2 on this one. Is it far away? It's a little bit. So I'm just going to grab the buggy and go around. Injuries detected. Oh, thank you, Clarice. But you never know. So why not just try to get a nice weapon or a pistol and go with it? Oh, there they are. Jesus, they just eat their own kind. I can just come back here later and harvest all of this to get some more electrical parts. That's fine. But uh, this isn't this... Oh, it's carbon. Yeah, the carbon is very easy to to, to mistake by with the molybdenum. So, yeah, I think it's just easy to go around. I'm going to go through the gold area. It's probably going to be a bunch of them there, but that's fine. Should be able to deal with them. That flooring rock is there since the beginning. It just stays there. It's got some power, some magic. But okay, seems to be right here in the middle. And uh, that's nice because it's just going to be a quick run. Unfortunately, it's not going to be a quick run at all. Because I'm pretty sure a lot of them is going to... Sh yeah, I, I already heard them. Where are they? Where are those little buggers? There they come. Charge. I'm going to run after you, buddy. One less concern for me. What about you? Are you hurt? Oh no, you're just dead. There's another one right there. They wait in the bushes for the right moment to strike. He strikes and he misses. And he ends up being just meat stew. That's how it goes. The circle of life. You charge, you become meat stew. Thank you very much. Let's pick it all up. Let's actually see how the... Okay, he's doing very good. Those points into the food consumption also helped. I don't need to eat or drink as much. So that's nice. Okay, good. So there's some magnesium. And, uh, well, I'm gonna need more. But I'm not gonna look for too much. So I just wanna see which mark. I think that's the number one, number two. Is it? Yeah, that's the number two. Okay, so let's go for the other one. And that should be enough to get a pistol going. I think that's gold nice let's just venture okay this one seems to be in the area where it's supposed to be where it used to be i should say that seems like nickel i just hope it's not underneath i'm gonna have to climb down maybe it's just right here uh oh this is a ghost yeah sometimes this happens or another possibility is i actually retrieved this node and it still shows on a map that's a good chance that that might be the case because this one isn't here but okay i'm just gonna go back i should have enough let's just see what this is this what this is is oh boy you're coming here too seems like they're spawning higher numbers now during the day and all you know I didn't encounter as many snobs in the beginning. The game is ramping up. Nice. More meats too. That's what he means. Cool. Okay, I'm not gonna even uh, harvest the other one. I'm just gonna take a little bit more nickel. I think I need. I don't have that much. That's Gromin over there, so... Well, maybe it's tin. Kinda looks... As yeah, it's tin, so let's take it. Oh, good find. So, carbon is very easy to mistake with molybdenum. Aluminum is very very easy to mistake with copper because it kind of shines a little bit and the tin is very similar to the chromium so, so I think sometimes it kind of pays off to actually go and see what it actually is at least in my case I get confused quite a bunch okay let's just keep going back 
I should have enough to do a pistol. I would prefer a good weapon, but uh, well, let's just do a pistol then. Another thing that I would like to figure out is where the beta mine is, because in the logs it said something about the beta mine. Injuries detected. Thank you, Clarice. Uh, so I would like to figure out, but I don't remember which one it is. So when I go by a, a, a mine, I actually forgot to do it on that one. I'm gonna check it out if it is the beta mine. Oh, there you go. I got my machete going. Nice. So that's cool. So I gotta. Oh, where, I left it there. So there you go. Hopefully this will work well. So let's see what I need for the pistol. It's the gun metal. So I needed the bronze. So okay. Let's just see what it takes to do some bronze. Copper. Let's do a couple. And for the gun metal, I also need zinc. Oh boy, I'm out of Oh, nice, I got some. Let's do a couple. And the rubber. And this and that. Cool. So let's get the pistol going. Nicely done. For the charges, Dimaloy. Let's see if I have some. I do. And power cells. It's power cells. Yeah, it's kind of expensive. But each one gives me three. I'm not sure how many I'm gonna I wanna do. Let's do one. Let's see if it actually gives three. It is just three. So I think I'm gonna do I don't know. Let's do them all. Yeah. Let's do fifteen. That should be good. And I'm gonna put it here. And let's see how the pistol works. One thing that used to happen is that if we would reload the weapon before we use up all the bullets, we lose that magazine. So I think it might be the same. Small and light weapon. Fires a charge ballast, requires ammo maintenance. Okay. Oh, it makes a poof. And something shows up in front. So it should work. I hope. Okay. So in terms of the weapon department, I think I'm doing good. I got a better metal weapon and a range weapon. So that's great. Now, I'm also going to try to see if I can do a little bit more bandages. So let's just pick all of this up. These are going to be useful. And let's do a little bit more of these. I can't really make the other ones. We used to make the other ones in the printer, but of course it's still not unlocked. So... And I'm going to have to do a little bit more cloth because of the... Okay, that should be enough. Because of the workbench, because I would definitely like to take it. So let's just leave these bar barriers here. These bodies. These berries and everything else. Let's just park away. Cool. So let's see if I have enough room to put all of this. I don't have room for the magnesium, so it's going to stay here for now. Okay, not too bad. Let me just recheck. So let's just fix the tools. And the chisel. That's nice. That's great. So also going to have a little meal. Is there someone there? Oh, it's my, my little buddy. Okay. I think I'm just gonna eat a berry. Or two. These ones take health out. So let's just eat these ones. Vital stabilized. Oh, thank you, Clarice. And we should be good to go. Just gonna put the meat inside. Yeah. I think I just noticed I can't run with a pistol in hand. I run a little bit faster without it. So I'm gonna try to remember that. Just park this. What? What is going on? I had a crate here and I had a kitchen. What seems to. So the biodome still requires that thing. The warrior claim results. And the oxygenator too. I got this thing. So the things that I fixed are gone, except for the bed at the chemistry table. I don't know what's going on. Oh man, I just lost a bunch of stuff. I had a crate here, a kitchen. Oh man, maybe they updated something and I lost a few things. I had a bunch of meat inside it. Oh, what a bummer. Well, let's just continue. But uh, it, it's definitely weird. 
Oh boy, I lost it all. So, I didn't upgrade the workbench, did I? But I, I kind of don't need to, so I'm going to leave the upgrade for the workbench for later. Let's just keep going. Let's see if I have something else here. Like, I'm just going to refill the buggy and keep going. Let's go back to the satellite dish because the mine is right next to it. Onwards. So since I'm going at it, let's see if this one is the better mine. It is the better mine. Oh yeah, so I'm gonna go into this one later. I think I already went into this one. I, I just don't remember because I went into a bunch of mines and it's kind of hard to remember which one it was. The one that I kind of remember a little bit better is the Zeta one because I used a, key, a blue key card on it and I need t two tier four cards. Oh, actually, I just need one to go into a couple of doors at the end of the tunnel. But this one I don't remember, so I'm gonna have to go. But it at least it's nice to know that the better mine is that one right next to me. That's great. So I'm gonna follow up the same path that I took the last time. It kind of worked. So let's just hope that I don't end, but end up in the desert again. <laughs> because it's really hard to come back up with a buggy. Okay, so through here should be good. Nice. There we go. There's a crawly. Good morning or good afternoon. How you do? It's quite late, but in the mine it should be good, because, you know, it's in the mine. I think it's actually a good time to go, because I can just spend the night inside it, and once I come out, maybe it's already daytime. Let's see. So there's the alpha mine. I'm not sure if it's the only Andrews, but at least it's one of them. There it is. Let's go in. I kind of saw a shadow and I thought, oh, like, oh Jesus, there's all the, and there's already monsters here. Look at these buggers. But it's just the snubs, so it should be okay. Hello, buddy. I got a, ni a new knife. Oh, it's worse than the other, isn't it? With a tactical knife, was just two hits. With this one, was three. But maybe it was just this time. So let's see up here. There's a box. Oh, baby. Red card. And I kind of just had an epiphany. I think the better mine required a red and a green card. At least I went into one mine that had two doors. One red, one re green. So maybe that's the one. Not sure. That was already a good find. But I'm going to have to activate the comms relay. So let's see. Oh, baby. Oh, and there's a pistol here. <laughs> okay. He paid for the trip. So I used up resources and I got him back. Not too bad. Hello. 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 Anybody out there? I got a knife. Watch out. So this is a big area. So let's just hug the, the right hand side wall here. And let's see, because I have a feeling it's going to be a few entrances to go to. There's the lights to follow. So it kind of helps. But on this side, it seems to be closed. Is that... Oh, kind of look like nodes up there. So let's see. I think I'm already halfway. Through the cave. This looks barricaded. Can I go on top of this? Yeah, it's just a wall. Okay. I don't think this is where I came from. I just want to make sure... Oh yeah, I came from over there, so this is the the only way to go, apparently. Okay. So let's pick up the pistol, shall we? Hello. 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 I come in peace. There's a bunch of notes. Nice. And I kind of see a feature there, but it's a rock. Nice. Okay, so just mercury, silver. Gold. In cobalt. So it's the same thing that I found in the Zeta mine. The Zeta mine had all these four nodes too. And looks like there's a cave in that direction. I didn't do what I did before. I should have just hugged the wall. But let's try to do that now. So I came from over here. Let's go to the left this time. Okay, so there's a way to go here. Well, let's take this one. So when I come back, I just make a right turn to go back. Sweet. 
Yeah, this is definitely different. There's another card, and it looks like it stops right here. Maybe I can do use dynamite. It reminds me of the forest, this part. And there's another lock. Probably another whistle. Let's listen. Yep, it is another whistle. But let's change. Let's uh, check the lock because it might say something useful. Oh, but it's the same one. Yeah, I don't. Or is this a new one? Numerous minerals and heavy metals of all kinds are abundant. It seems the wind has swept away the dust revealing the heavy metals left behind. Is he talking about the desert? I think he might be talking about the desert. I already know that there are not a lot of nodes in there. I already went there. So nothing new there. A lot of theirs. So let's go there. And I just noticed that I actually have something in the compass there. Mine exit B comms relay 1. So that's where I have to go, apparently. I just noticed it. I was just looking around me. Not that there's a lot to see, but I mean, it could be something hiding. So I'm in the main cave. I, I For now, I still know where I am, where I have to go to go back. So I just want to see if there's something else. And oh, look at that. There's a crawly. But this one seems to be poisonous. I don't want to touch it. But he doesn't get... Oh, he cares. Is he coming my way? Oh, hello. Good morning. Is it morning? What's morning? Yeah, I guess I guess you don't know, right? If you've been here for all your life. So, this is the other entrance. Uh, oxygen low. Yeah, I got I got bottles. And okay, nice. There's a staircase. Pistol time. I don't have a good weapon. I got a pistol. Okay, there's another crate. Something under the stairs. Uh, doesn't look like it. So what does this thing have? Normal stuff, but good stuff. And I still have a bunch of room. That's great. It's a long one. Oh boy. I think when I get out, it's actually going to be evening again. Tight squeeze. There we go. There's plant fiber, which is kind of useful in case we need to do a bandage or something. Oxygen levels dangerous. Oh, thank you, Clarice. I'm still 48%, you know. It's kind of half. So we should be okay for now. This is methane. Okay. So in fact we now have more sources of hydrocarbon solution because now the mines also have this thing so it's not just the lakes outside and I'm already out and there's another pistol with a bunch of laser cells let's see 25 45 are these better 15 25 so they are better so how do you reload a different type of ammo unequip no, then equip it just to take it out of the hand. I'm not sure how I would use the different ammo. But okay, I guess I'll figure it out later. I didn't pick it up, so there you go. Nice. And I got another lock here. Oh, decrypt at a computer to no learn new blueprint. Oh, nice. But I sure hope that the computer stays because, you know, as we've seen before, everything that I fixed in the Phoenix base disappeared. Almost everything. So where am I? I mean, I think I know, but I'm not sure if that's... No, that's not what I think. Okay, I think I know. So the starting area is just down this way. Okay, let's use the pistol. Now that I got some extra ammo. Oh, two shots. Three. Okay, it was kind of fun. It's always fun to use a ranged weapon. Okay. I know where I am, but I didn't find what I was looking for, did I? I was supposed to activate comms relay, so maybe I missed something inside. I'm not sure. Or was I, was I supposed to just retrieve this data disk? But the buggy is on the other side, so I think I'm going to go back in through the same area that I came through. Yeah, it's still saying comms relay, so I guess I missed it. So let's go back in. 
and see if I can spot that thing because I totally didn't see what I was supposed to see. Comms relay one. Okay. Now I think it's time to use up uh, an oxygen bottle. There you go. My food in water is doing good. So let's just keep going. 400 meters. Maybe it was on that big cave. And it looks like there's a... Oh boy. There's a bunch of snubs there. The zoom is a little strange. I don't think it can come up here. Nicely done. I'm not sure if I'm hitting it. Let's go down. Oh boy. I, I'm not sure where I am. Is this the same cave that I've been before? I haven't been on this place. Okay, let's not argue with it. Let's just keep going. Because, yeah, I'm a little confused. Maybe I took a different route to come here. But oh, there's a box. Let's see what it has. Smith lock 2, Collins lock 1. Okay. Let's listen to them and see if something shows up. There you go. So let's check the locks. I'm not sure which one it is. Vega and I have been charting out the mines left here by the units. Strangely, have yet to find any of the bots. I wish it didn't disappear as fast. But they may have just buried themselves deep inside to protect themselves from the elements and await our arrival. Okay. The flight team was amazing. I never thought I'd get to land on an alien war. I'm literally pinching myself. There's a lot to do. I'll be shuttling all week, bringing down supplies from the Phoenix as long as the dust storms keep calm. Okay, so they kind of explored around maybe the other planets. Let's just keep going. I was kind of thinking maybe I had to come into the beta mine one, into the alpha mine one where I entered ne next to the satellite dish, come out where I did and come back in. But, uh, and this thing changed while I left the mine. That's what I was thinking, but I don't think that might be the case. I might, I might actually have missed another hallway. I don't know. I would have to go back and watch the video because I totally didn't think that I was missing something, but apparently, apparently I did. Okay, I'm getting close. 200 meters. It's not that close. Okay, and it keeps going. Oxygen levels dangerous. Thank you, Clarice. Very useful. I'm down to 40%. I've been running because I'm kind of getting... Okay, there's more things. I don't know if I'm going to have room for it all. If there's more stuff to pick up, I might have to do some choices here. Oh, key card green. Nice. So I think I can go into the beta mine and open up those two doors. Hopefully, that's the one that had the green and red. Nice. So, it's already morning. And I still haven't reached... So, where is it? Am I going the right way? There's another box here. And I'm getting really full. But okay, I gotta check the boxes because could, could, it could have uh, new keycards. Oh, hello. I'm gonna melee this time. It's just nubs. I was actually expecting to find big crab monsters, but apparently not, so it should be okay. Let's just took it out. Let's just wait here. It's just you guys. There he goes. Got some nice range, this, this machete, of course. He only has range if I hit it in the right moment. Come along, buddy. I got stuff to do, you know? Nicely done. Okay, you just do your thing. In a few seconds, I'll turn and see if I hit it in the right moment. Is he coming? Still thinking about it. There he comes. Charge. This kind of looks like the cave where I was before, but there's a door here. Let's see. It's going to be really tough to find a way back now. And I need uh, another box, basically. And I have to find another box. Because I don't have the tier 4. So I wonder. 
if it's like uh, a sequence i'm gonna have to go into the tier two and three and inside those ones i might find the tier four so i guess my only choice now is to go out and try to go to the mine that had the green and the red which i think it was the better but i'm not sure and i have to investigate now the, the problem will be to find my way out of here oh but there's a pointer there I think I should be okay if I just follow the compass. So let's just go this way. And the lights too. Okay, so we definitely took a while to reach here. But okay, at least I know. Let's see if the box respond. No, it did not. Well, let's recap also. So I got a couple of cards. A green and a red, which is great. I got a few pistols, ch chisels, and a bunch of different resources. Ammo, and also this data disk. So I'm definitely going to try to fix the computer disk back at base and try to decrypt that thing. I just hope it doesn't disappear on me because that was unfortunate. I lost the kitchen, I lost the crates, I lost the water reclaimer. Maybe they removed it because of the bug of the water reclaimer. So maybe that's not a bad thing. Let's just refill the auction and try to find my way out of here. It's probably going to take a while. Oh, this one has no stuff. Did I miss this one? I think I might have missed these cards. So let's see what I messed up here. How the hell did I miss this whole pathway? I think I might have come from a decent side. So this is the second mine. Where I exited the alpha mine entrance B. So I guess I must have come from there. Oh yeah, I see. I came from this side. And I went to the door and there was this pathway here on my left. Okay, so this thing was here the whole time. I just was just... You know, because in this game it's kind of easy to make these assumptions. Because in previous versions the mines were copy and paste. It were kind of repetitive and they kind of circle around into a loop. So we kind of don't know. At least I don't. Oh, there's malignum. If I was missing something, or the game was just playing tricks on me, you know? <laughs> or apparently I did miss it. But that's nice. It's still pretty early. So that's great. I didn't get to activate the comms relay, but I got somewhere to go. Unfortunately, I came out in this mine. But I'm not that far. I'm far from the buggy though. Oh, motherfucker. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's going to be faster to go from the outside or from the inside. So I think I'm just going to run at it, try to get the buggy and go back to base. And uh, try to decipher what is this thing. If it's like um, the hovercraft, it's kind of cool. But e either way, whatever it is, it's probably going to be something nice. 